In this video, we will be reviewing the accounts payable processes in Dynamics NAV 2016. And I am actually logged into the accounts payable coordinator role center. And we're going to start by looking at a vendor. And um, I've got my office supply vendor here in the my vendors list. So let's go ahead and, and look at my office supply vendor. In the general tab, you can see we're collecting basic information, name and address, and we can collect uh, information about how we communicate with that vendor, you know, phone, email, homepage, that sort of thing. I'm going to roll down here into the payments area. The couple things that I want to point out here, first of all, is the payment terms code. And notice that you can, as well as using uh, just standard terms, you can also have terms discounts. Um, and NAV will calculate your discount for you. And also the payment method. So in this case, I'm, I'm paying this vendor with a check. You can also record the IRS 1099 code, and that's actually just the box and the form. So all of the, the standard boxes and forms are listed here. Probably the most common is non-employee compensation, so the 1099 miscellaneous. I want to bring your attention over to the right side where we can see the statistics for this vendor. I'm able to see uh, the balance and actually the overdue amount as well, so there's a difference between the two. I can also see the, the number of documents that have been processed for this vendor, purchase orders, invoices, that sort of thing. I want to talk about dimensions for a second. So for this particular vendor, because they're in California, um, I've, I've made the decision that the default division dimension for this vendor will be California. Um, and that's because typically when we buy from this vendor, it's going to be posted to or distributed to that California division. And for department, I've chosen administration. And these are defaults that can be changed at the time of the transaction. Additional dimensions can be applied as well. But these are the defaults that I've chosen for this particular vendor 